Hello everyone. Welcome to Brain Blitz Audios. Today we will be looking at a math doku puzzle and how to solve a 3 by 3 puzzle in an easy way. Please do watch our introduction episode to know more about math doku. So, this is the method we are going to use to solve a 3 by 3 puzzle. The objective is to fill the grid in with the digits 1 through 3. 1. Identify the cages and mark them as A, B, C, etc. 2. Note down the options available for each cage operation. 3. If there is only one option, then mark it on the puzzle. 4. Choose the option from others which meets the criteria to complete the puzzle. Now, let's start solving a 3x3 math doku puzzle. Let's name our cages. This will be cage A, this will be cage B, and this will be cage C. In cage A, there are three cells, and the operation is addition. After adding, the, our result must be 6. So the options, there is only one option, which is 1 plus 2 plus 3. Now, cage B has three cells, and the operation is addition. After adding, our result must be 8. So the, there's only one option, which is 3 plus 3 plus 2. For cage C, there are three cages, and the operation is addition. After adding, our result must be 4. So, for cage C, there is again only one option which is 2 plus 1 plus 1. Now, let's start solving. In cage B, it is 3 plus 3 plus 2. Now, you know that no numbers can be repeated in any row or column. So, 3, 3, 2 cannot be here. That format will not come. 3, 3, here 3, here 3, and here 2 will not come. So the only option is to write 3 over here, 3 over here, and 2 over here. Same case for cage C. We'll write 2 over here, 1 over here, and 1 over here. Now, for completing this row, here it will be 1, here, 2, and here, 3. Let's pre-check the puzzle. 1 plus 2 plus 3 is equal to 6, 3 plus 2 plus 3 is equal to 8, and 1 plus 2 plus 1 is equal to 4. Now, let's solve another math doku puzzle. This will be cage A, this will be cage B, this will be cage C, and this will be cage D. In cage A, there are three cells, and the operation is addition. After adding, our result must be 5. So, for case A, there are two options. 2 plus 2 plus 1 and 1 plus 3 plus 1. In case B and C, as cage B and C is same, we will write the options for it similarly. So, for uh, both of the cages, there are two cages, uh, two cells, and the operation is addition. After the operation, our result must be 4. So, there is only one option, 3 plus 1. For cage D, there are two cells. The operation is minus. 
after subtracting it, our result must be 1. So, there are two options. 3 minus 2 and 2 minus 1. Let's go with B, uh, cage B and cage C as these cages only have one option. We don't know the position of 3 and 1 in both of these, so we'll write it in the middle. 3 and 1 for cage C and 3 and 1 for cage B. Now, for completing this column, we will write 2 over here. And for completing this column, we'll write 2 over here. Now, here, there is only 2 in one option. So, this option will be cut. And we get the option here. Now, 2 can't be here, as it will be a repeat of 2 in the same row. So, we write 2 over here and 1 over here. So, for completing this row, it will be 3 over here and 1 over here. And for completing this row, it will be 3 over here. And for completing this column, 1 and 3. Then, let's recheck our puzzle. 2 plus 1 plus 2 is equal to 5. 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. And 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. This is all about math doku. Was it interesting? For more useful videos, please subscribe to our channel. See you soon. Bye bye.